YouTube. It's your boy Gaming Dad, and I'm back with another one. Oh, Nintendo, we love you so much, but then you make us rage because the fact that you don't have natural Bluetooth in the Switch. You got us out here looking like straight bozos. Well, YouTube, we just might have a solution for this problem. This is the review and unboxing of the Goalie Kit Root Air Bluetooth Audio Transceiver. Now, YouTube, you know these devices have been out for a long time. There have been different variations of them, but I just wasn't sold on them yet. I was like, you know what, I mean, these things are just a little too big. What happens if, you know, one of those things was just a snap and break, and then I have a, a piece in my Switch that I have to deal with? So, you know what, I had to sit back and wait until the right product came around that I felt like, hey, it kept my Switch looking sleek. It wasn't like I just had this extra nipple hanging out, and here it is. All right, let's get into a little unboxing of the Root Air. Let's see what's in the box. Uh -oh. Well, can't take that back. I had to put some tape on that. All right, comes in a really nice case. Nice plasticky case. Got some instructions and yeah, I got some instructions right here. Set Bluetooth earphones. All right, the instructions going on here. All right, the back, get the unit, go a little, let's get into it. All right. Um, yeah, let's see what's this on in here. Here's the unit. Puts off the side. This is some form of USB, USC charger. Get a little closer. All right. Now we have here. We have the unit that comes apart easily. All right. So I don't know what this part does. But this is the part that fits in the bottom of the switch. Kind of light. Oh, hey, oh, got buttons at the bottom. Got an A and a B button. I have some lights to go home here at the bottom. Probably look into that. All right, we'll get into it. See what it looks like on the switch. All right, we're gonna get in and get ready to uh, put this in the system. USB, we turn that up already. All right, so that's, that's how easy it is for the switch. So to pair it, you are gonna need to hold one of these buttons here. You hold it down, but you also have to hold the button on your iPad Pro here and then allow them to come close. Once you allow them to come close, they will pair and voila, you're in business. So I wanted to see if, if it works with the switch. And the switch is a little, uh, it's not as thick. The switch light is not as thick as the regular switch, but they're close, but it's not as flush. I think this is more designed here. To take a part of uh, the switch. So let's see if it works. It's in there snug. USB connected. Now let's see if I need to. I don't know. Oh, there it is. It, it, it recognizes connect, and there it is. It connects just. It takes a little bit to get on, but it, it connected just fine. I hear all the sound crystal clear, and that's awesome. So we have we have the unit that we you know we're gonna use. Well, then we we're wondering like, you know, what is this for? I thought at first, cause they don't give you instructions. They don't tell you exactly what it's for. So I thought this thing was like maybe to allow yourself to charge it, you know, charge your switch while this was still connecting. I thought maybe you put the, the piece into the back of this here, like such. 
and I thought that this was it. You know what? You could maybe hook this up to a portable charger and you could still get the same Bluetooth action. But no, but this unit has to be connected. So I'm like, man, what is this piece for? And I finally figured it out. Um, what you do is, because this is a USB, you plug the, you, if you say, for instance, if you're playing your OG switch, not the switch light. Now, this is the difference, not the switch light. But if you get the OG switch, you just plug the OG switch into the dock. You plug this part into the dock with your part connected and voila now you got bluetooth in your headphones from your tv man this is a winner this by far and i looked at it and i took a long time before i decided to want to pick up one of these but knowing that that is a winner buddy that this that takes the cake because now not only can my, do my bluetooth work in his head um in handheld mode it also works in dock mode great situation so before i get into my verdict let me give you some buyers beware now i purchased this um, unit and it did not come with the mic so i had to go back and rebuy another one because my son wanted one and i got his and his had the mic but they're both the same price they sold by two different companies on amazon but one has the mic and one does not have the mic so buyers beware when you look into this and so i was able to go back and give you some guys some comments on how it is with and without the mic well my opinion on the mic is if you have it in handheld mode it is perfect they hear you clear my son was playing on fortnite the communication going back and forth was excellent but if you put it in dock mode you have to be kind of close to the dock you know pretty much an arm's length away for them to be able to hear you clearly so it works perfect in handheld mode but it is a womp womp in dock mode so my final score i give it a 4.5 out of 5 for these reasons one the design is small it's sleek if it's right into the switch second it works it pairs instantly as soon as you click third it works perfectly with my airpod pros fourth it works in dock mode even though i knocked a couple points off definitely for it might not being able to work as good as i would like it to in dock mode but man just to have the headphones on being away from the tv it gives me a nice immersive experience if you have the AirPod Pros and you're able to cut on the noise cancellation man you are in for a treat YouTube there's many ways you can support the channel feel free to hit the subscribe button or follow us on the many of social media sites we're on TikTok at gaming dad zero we're on Instagram at gaming dad three we are on Twitter at gaming underscore dad three um, if you really want to support us and we would really love your support, become a Patreon supporter. Uh, we got tiers as small as $1 a month. Um, we would love for you guys to be a part of that. Don't forget good people to hit the like button. If you didn't like the video, you know what? Hit the dislike button. But leave a comment below just to let us know what we did wrong, how we can improve. This is your boy Gaming Dad. We love y'all. God bless. And we out. Peace.